been tough to to have that success early and then uh, and then deal with these injuries. So you know, I felt like I was kind of on the fast track and uh, you know put myself in a good situation to have a chance to go up to Boston. And uh, now missing two years, um, you know, it, it, I'm just uh, just excited to be playing now. You know, and hopefully. Uh, Hopefully I can get back up there at some point, but but for now I'm not taking any, anything for granted and just enjoying playing. You know, I, I skipped I skipped low A and then I I was pretty much uh, went high A, double A, and then triple A, and and I, and I felt like I, I was ready that year. So yeah, I definitely felt like I went faster than I expected. I got injured in, in spring training of 09. I, I hurt my ankle. Um, I hit I hit like a ball down the line, a double, and I kind of. Stepped on first base weird and just jammed my ankle and ended up uh, having having to get a bone taken out of my out of my ankle. I ended up playing uh, uh, probably for three or four weeks uh, on on my injured ankle and then it just it got to the point where I, I couldn't even walk anymore. So I, and that was the last time I, I played in any games. Um, to be honest, I, there wasn't one specific thing that, that caused my shoulder injury. It just I I came back and uh, started throwing and hitting and stuff and I, I felt fine. Then all of a sudden. One day, uh, one day after uh, workouts, my shoulder just started killing me, and uh, they found out that my my shoulder joint was my capsule was really loose, and they had to tighten it up. And it, you know, it just I thought it was just minor at the time, and it just never got better. So I ended up having a surgery. Uh, it was definitely tough, you know, um, especially with the shoulder. Like if I've had a I've had ankle surgery, had elbow surgery, shoulders ten times harder than anything I've had. So. That was tough, you know. I went through I went through times where where I thought about, you know, this might be it for me, you know, where I, I don't know if I want to do this anymore. But you know, just being hurt for two years, it's just mentally it's a grind. So you know, you, you go through a lot of ups and downs. So you know, I look back and I'm just just happy to, to be out here right now. You know, you kind of uh, you go through phases in rehab where where you feel like you're not getting better and you kind of kind of joke around and be like, you know, oh, I'm going to quit. I can't do this anymore. You know, joke around with other guys that are hurt or whatever. And, but actually this off season, I, I, I told a couple of my buddies, I was like, Hey, I think, I think I might be done because my shoulder wasn't feeling very good. Like throwing, it was killing. And I, I was just like, if I can't throw, I can't play anymore. And, you know, I've already missed two seasons. I don't know how good I'm going to be when I come back and everything. So definitely thought about it, but I, I, I'm glad now that I didn't. So hopefully it works out. I feel normal swinging. Uh, one thing I've done different is I, I used to finish with one hand and I'm finishing with two hands now, so that's a little different. But um, as far as the throwing goes, I'm not 100% with that yet. It, it's getting better. Uh, I played some first base and I, I feel good enough to do that. But um, as far as like playing outfield, I, I got some work to do with the arm. So it's not 100%. I guess, I mean, the obvious goal is just just to, to get up to Boston, you know, and, uh, and uh, actually, actually before that probably is just to feel 100% physically, that's, that's the number one goal.